How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. As always, it is a beautiful day because we have a brand new legend arrive in Brawlhalla. Magyar, the Spectral Guardian. The last remaining Stratsky. I think that word means guardian or like bodyguard or something like that. Is ready to battle in the grand tournament with great sword and hammer. He comes with three skins that you can purchase, the Golden Gladiator, the Phantom of the Armor, and the Pharaoh King, which we will be playing a game with each of his new skins. So definitely stick around if you want to see me playing all of those skins. And also the new rank season 19 starts on January 20th, and today is January 14th, so if you're watching this today, you have only six days to grind your glory and reach that diamond or platinum or gold or whatever you're trying to reach. So, let's check out the store. I actually already bought the skins for uh, Magyar. This is what they look like. We got Pharaoh King Magyar. Comes with the Afterlife Hammer and the Great Kopesh Great Sword. Looks awesome. The Mummy Returns. <laughs> we have Phantom of the Armor. This is probably one of my favorite ones for Magyar. I really love the Rose Hammer, but especially the Rose Great Sword. Check it out, the Cold Embrace. It actually has like a rose hilt. Very cool. With the vines wrapping around. They did a great job on that skin. And then Golden Gladiator Magyar. A lot of people said they didn't really like this one, but I actually think it's pretty cool. And uh, also, the Gladius Magnus is a pretty cool looking sword as well. So, without further ado guys, let's go ahead and play a game. Now, if you haven't seen uh, Magyar and what he is capable of, I'm going to try to explain the moves as I go. But I've only played him like two or three times, so as you can see, I'm only level two. So yeah, I, I don't really know very much about him yet. As much as you guys do, basically. <laughs> so, we'll, we'll see how we do. I'm happy just because I have another legend to get level 25 with. Check out the lock-in animation. You can see the eyes actually go into his helmet and whatnot. They did a really good job on these colors as well. The glow from, like, the souls. Look at the charged OG. Oh my goodness, that looks good. So, I'm just going to go ahead and use this one, I think, for the first match. The default skin. And then we'll go ahead and use... Uh, the other skins in, in other matches. But check out his stats. Nine defense. Woo. Unfortunately, I don't have any stances. We actually have to level him up a little bit. So here we go, guys. First game recording with Magyar. Hopefully, I don't suck so bad. But he's, he's a really good legend. It's just like his sigs are kind of going to take some time to get used to. Like, for instance, the down sig on Hammer here, it actually lunges you forward a little bit. And you have to get used to that. Um, and if you do it off edge, it does go downwards a little bit, but no matter what, even if you gravity cancel, it does slide you forward a little bit, which is kind of cool. All right, going against a diamond. Okay, glides. Hopefully, uh, yeah, I don't get wrecked here, but it's just our third game with Megar, so we'll see how we do. If you're wondering about my maps, these are Hollow Knight maps. They're a mod. Uh, you can check it out for yourself. I did a video on this mod, so... Yo! This guy is really good at hammer, better than me. So if I could beat him, that would be awesome. Ooh, got him with that tipper. No. Yeah, oh my goodness. We actually got him and he is good with the hammer. Hopefully all my training with hammer has paid off, eh? I will say, oh, that was sick. The greatsword does feel a lot slower. I'll say that much. Oh, wow. Like, when you do a side sig with the greatsword, I feel like I don't even know what's going to happen because I'm not used to how it looks or anything. You know what I mean? Yo! 
Yo, we got him there, bros. Ooh, this is a fun legend. I gotta say, he looks so cool, too. I would have hit with that down six so bad. No, he got me. Woo, I made it. Oh man, that side sig hits hard. Almost got him with that down sick too. GG dude, GG. All right, two stock with the default skin. Let's go, man. Vagar is fun. Look at all the XP I'm getting too. The colors just look so good. All right, let's do Golden Gladiator Magyar this time. Uh, I guess I'll, oops. No, let's use his default weapons just to start it out with. I will, like later on in videos, you guys know I like to switch up the weapons, the colors, everything, but just for the first try, we'll just use default, uh, Default weapons and everything. Let's do community colors. I'll be dropping community colors in the comments after the premiere. So I usually drop codes like every single video. So if you're new to my channel, definitely look out in the comments after every premiere because I'm dropping those codes. All right, going against an Ember. She only has two or three defense, maybe four. It like depends on the stance. I didn't see which stance she was rocking, but definitely ain't gonna be anywhere in like the nine defense that we have, so. Oh man, she actually had a really good down air there. I didn't even touch her and she died. I don't even think I hit her once. Don't ask me how that move hits. I don't even know what I'm doing with it. Yo, we got her again! That down sig scares everybody so much, I feel like. When you start throwing out that down sig, they're just like, oh gosh. Oh! <laughs> Wasn't expecting that, but guess I should have. Oh my gosh, I meant to do a side air and it just didn't happen. No splash damage on that, apparently. It's all good and fun, Ember, but I got so much defense, it's gonna take you like 5,000 hits to kill me once. Oh, that was so crazy. That's game. Oh man. I like that she was like over that slap and honestly I'm surprised it didn't kill me but I have so much defense and it's just like nothing kills me. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine Magar in 2v2? I bet you he's crazy good. In fact, let's go ahead and try once. At least one game of 2v2. Let's try. I bet you he's crazy good. We're gonna do Phantom of the Armor Magyar for our first 2v2 game. Uh, let's do Soulfire. That actually looks really good. Hopefully my teammate is also Magyar, so we can just <laughs> have like 18 defense between the two of us. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to try 10 defense Zul versus 10 de defense, or 10 strength Zul versus 10 defense Magyar. That would be <laughs> an interesting game. Oh man, my teammate's the only non-Magyar. Oh my gosh, poor Mordex. Surrounded by great swords and hammers of death. Oh man. All right, Mordex will... You're gonna have to try to do the the attacking and I will do the defending, all right, bro? 
<laughs> hey! Oh no! No, Mark! Mordex! I can't even tell who's like on my team because we're like all the same color. <laughs> Out the, I was the sacrifice. I was the distraction. Oh my goodness, Greatsword is so much slower, guys. It's so noticeable. It is no longer broken, I can confirm. I want to hit with that, that neutral sig so bad, though. Oh, I was gonna hit with it too. Yeah! I got him! Ooh, that's a good one. You like do two hits on the side and then finish with the neutral sig because people almost always jump after those two hits. That's actually a good. Oh my gosh, I took that crocky in the face! Come on, Mordex! I'm on my final stock! Oh man. Alright, there we go. I gotta make sure this guy dies. Nice. Dang, Mordex, you are good, bro. I am not known for my 2v2 prowess, but... Oh gosh. I can't die, I'm on my final stock, no! Oh my gosh. No! I had the recovery, but they were just double teaming me too hard on the edge there. Come on, Mordex, I believe you got two stocks! Yeah, the double Megar, man. So much defense, and yet Mordex over here just... Oh. All right, well, he's on last stock. Dominating. They are in, uh, you know, they're damaged, but, oh my gosh, they both have, they both have great sword. This is, oh gosh, Mordex, I, I am so sorry I died so fast. <laughs> I, I'll stick to 1v1s. 2v2 is definitely not my strong suit. Oh my goodness. I, I would love to see, like I said, 10 strength, Zul, and 10 defense, Magyar. How about on a, instead of versus each other, how about on a team? That would be so cool. All right, Mordex, he got one of them. Let's go, baby. We can still get that win. Oh. Nah, it's got to take way more than that, dude. Magyar is way too much damage. Who is this? Oh, Kyo is my teammate. All right, Kyo. Nice. Oh, that was almost the game. He's weapon starving. Magyar's getting a little nervous. Okay, he got the hammer. Oh, that hammer looks so cool on the eSports colors, dude. How do you have eSports colors for this guy already? Dang. They must have saved codes and then, like, just unlocked them right when Magyar came out. Oh, this is a good fight. Oh! GG! Kayo, oh my goodness. He carried me hard, dude. I only did 378 damage. Well, thank you for the carry. And thank you for the strength stance. Let's go. All right, let's go back to 1v1. That was that was cool at all, but let's go back to 1v1. All right, let's try uh, Pharaoh King Magyar. Oh, that looks good. It almost looks like Skyforge colors. Almost, almost. And if you want to see what all those other colors look like, just go into training. Or even better yet, if you can, uh, if you're on PC, go to the image render tool and you can look at even more colors. Um, let's use, to our, uh, let's use community colors, I guess. And let's try out the strength stance. It takes away from decks. <laughs> oh well, let's just try it. No, I already did community colors one time. Let's do synthwave. 
It looks pretty cool. Alright, 1v1 with Magyar, the Pharaoh King. Let's go. Alright, going against Meek. Another eSports Colors Magyar. Where are these guys getting these eSports Colors? I want it to. In time, in time. We'll get it. We'll get it. You just gotta watch those uh, Brawlhalla eSports streams. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> Boom! How did that not scoop him? Ooh. Oh my goodness. Yeah, no, great sword not that good anymore, bro. You're gonna have to Oh okay, it's still pretty decent though. It's still pretty decent. Boom! There it is. Off the ceiling neutral sig, let's go. Look at how much I fly with that. I love that. No, 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 you're not getting me with that death crawl, man. Oh, that side sig is nice. Oh my goodness! The rec the the ground pound got me. That's okay. He's in deep red on his uh, second stock, so we got pretty good advantage here. Baby, he was doing some damage to us there. He was. That's all right. Oh, nice throw. Nice throw. Dang, I shouldn't have recovered so fast. Hmm. There it is. There it is. GG dude, GG. Dang, he was hard to kill, but then again it's Magyar. <laughs> he has nine defense, you know what I mean? GG dude, GG. Alright. Did I play every single skin? I did. Alright guys, so that means we're pretty much done with the initial playthrough of Magyar, and that means it's time for my final thoughts. Is Magyar the best greatsword legend? Let's start there. Uh, no. I think Mako or Jayon are still better, just because Mako, the Katar sigs are still amazing. I think they're better. The neutral sig, the down sig, and the side sig, they're I mean, Mako's faster. Look at that speed. I personally think Mako's better. My opinion is not law. So just because I think Mako's better than Magyar doesn't mean that's necessarily true. Uh, I just like the stats better on Mako and I also like the weapons. But 
Is Magar better than Jayon? Again, I, I think Jayon's better. Better sigs, better weapons, better stats. But Magyar is still awesome. And we're still going to do a lot more videos with Magyar. I want to do triple greatsword strikeout. I want to do 10 defense Magyar versus 10 strength. And so many other ideas. So definitely like this video if you enjoyed. Subscribe for future notifications of awesome new Brawlhalla videos and news. And more. And as always... This is Lucian Sword, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope to see you in the next one. Take it easy, friends.